Good morning, YouTubers. Today, I'd like to show you a solution for your vid, for your mod, if um, it does not see the atomizer. Um, now, let me show you. This morning, I used um, the J Bob. Now, you can see 0.18, it can see my atomizer. Let me just take a quick drag on it. try it on this one I haven't used this for a while this is the smog atomizer and I noticed something somewhere here you can see it's a little bit coated so let's see if the atomizer is going to work if it doesn't I have a couple of things I could use and I'll show you a quick way to do it so now I'll take this one off And I'm going to put it here. Now, before I do that, let me switch the batteries. So we get the, uh, the positive. Put the positive here. and all. Then we put the atomizer. Let's give you a little bit You see it keeps on saying no atomizer. So obviously it's very obvious that the um, coating is stopping the flow of electricity between the um, RDA and the mod. So now we have to do a little quick solution for this. So stand by. I'll get this one off. Okay. And then I'll take this one off again. It's good that before you do anything with the atomizer, you take this battery off. Now there are two ways of us fixing this. Um, I have a cotton tip here. And then I have a nail polish remover. This has some um, alcohol inside, which you could use to, you know, clean out coated uh, materials or elements. So let's see if that would work. If we try it, if it doesn't work, then I would have to go with um, plan B of um, trying to scrape out the coat on it. Okay, so let's see. Just need a little bit of this. So deep. Okay. So I need a little bit of this. And then let's see if this works. If you can see. You can see it's pretty dirty. Very, very dirty. Hmm. All right, take the other side, the dry side. Let's try to clean out. Uh. Still looks, let's take, let's give it one more clean. So far, it looks as if it's clean enough. Okay. Just a gently, gentle one. All right. So we'll go back and put the batteries. Okay. 
so this is negative and this is uh, positive here so let's put this one here and uh, close it out here okay then we'll get back the atomizer let's see still says no atomizer all right then we go for the hard way okay. all right so we get this out and we try to scrape a little bit of this Another thing we could do is to get a foil. We could get an aluminium foil to act as a conductor. That we could do. So let's see if hopefully this would work. So we take more of this and we just try to clean more out because we had tried this before and um, it didn't work so we had a little bit of scrape to scrape it out a little and um, so let's take this one out and just clean all the things out that we've scraped out so let's see Dun -dun -dun. Voila, you can see 2.9 volts. Let's try to puff it and see if it works. Yep, <coughs> it's back, baby. So, very easy. Anytime you have no atomizer, you could do two things you could either clean it with a q tip and a nail polish, which I used. Or, if that don't work, you could just scrape the top out and then use um, uh, the nail polish to clean it out again and um, it should work. So, I hope you enjoyed my video on how to DIY no atomizer and um, you basically don't need much, alright? So now that I got my mod back it's back to vaping all right if you like this please um, like share and subscribe and um, stay blessed oops stay blessed stay classy and stay beautiful bye bye